Before I start this video, I want to thank Undertaker Freak 1127 and Stop My Server talking about this topic. And also, this goes out to all the people who are struggling in Detroit every day. And I feel for all those people because I do have family members from my mother's side that live in Detroit. Hell, my mom was born and grew up in Roseville, Michigan, which is part of Detroit. And this is for all of you people. So basically what's going on is that in struggling Detroit, we're the financially strapped city, <clears throat> excuse me, which filed for bankruptcy a year ago, has cut off water to thousands of residents who owe unpaid bills. A notorious group, PETA, <clears throat> now says it will pay off the water debts for 10 of the approximately 17,000 Detroit families who have seen their water shut off. Now, most people would say, oh, that's great, due to all the fact that PETA has done all this crazy fucked up shit, that seems pretty reasonable, paying off these, uh, these water debts for these people. But under one condition, those families must agree to eat only a vegan diet for 30 days. PETA even offers to help the process by giving each family in addition to cash for water bills, a basket of healthy vegan food and recipes. The last thing that people who are struggling need is increased health care costs, PETA's Michelle Kritzer said in a blog post Friday. By accepting our offer to go vegan, not only will families be getting an immediate financial boost in helping animals, if they stick with it, they'll also lower their risk of obesity, heart disease, cancer, diabetes, and strokes. Now, most of you people will say, you know, why, why are you getting rallied up Atticus of Death Metal, or why are you getting rallied up? Why has Stoutmeister and Undertaker Freak 1127 gotten rallied up on this issue? Well, I'll tell you why. Basically, they're saying, go vegan or will not pay your water bills. They're basically dangling. They're basically just dangling like the water bill in front of these people, saying, we're not going to pay your water bills unless you go on a vegan diet for 30 days, that's basically a ransom. That's basically, that's basically a fucking ransom. Now, of course in America we say, we don't negotiate with terrorists. Well, pretty much, that's like saying, you know, you do not uh, negotiate with fucking PETA. Basically, they're going to keep on, they're going to make you do this offer, and they're going to keep putting the fucking pressure onto these unfortunate people. I mean, good fucking God, PETA. These people just need their water. They just need their fucking god forsaking water just to survive. And you're going to shove your dietary beliefs down their fucking throats. My grandmother's throats. My aunts and uncles throats. My cousins throats. That's what you're doing, PETA. Now, I made, I made a video on you motherfuckers one time trying to convert Dahmer's boyhood home into a vegan restaurant, which was a stick slap in the face to all the victims of the victims' families who were affected by Dahmer's sick, fucked up mind. But thankfully, there's this um, one site, which is like Turn on Detroit's Water, where they pretty much match people in Detroit to 4,000 plus donors who direct water bill help. And actually, this thing has helped a lot more people in Detroit than PETA has done. So, good fucking God, PETA. You people are, compar you people are comparable to the Westboro Baptist Church because you're basically fucking shoving down your dietary beliefs down these desperate people people's throats. Detroit has been through so much shit. It looks, I, I can't, I'm not going to paint a pretty picture on Detroit. I've been there a couple times. It's not pretty. And I do feel for all those people in Detroit. But you go around and dangle the promise of paying their water bill and saying you must go on a 30 day diet of nothing but eating vegan food and having vegan recipes. I can't allow that. 
That's fucking stupid. And of course, you know, you know, most of you people say, well, Atticus, you know, all they're saying is like, it will reduce like diabetes and stuff. Well, I understand that. If you eat a lot of red meat, that's going to fuck up your digestive system. It's all about moderation. Hell, I eat meat. I eat vegetables. I'm an omnivore. Also, I work out three days a week. So that is all in moderation. I know how to keep myself healthy and all right. And I, I, and I exercise three days a week. And you're going to go around and say, oh, the only way to keep yourselves healthy is having a vegan diet. Well, well you know, you, you, you people are just fucking ridiculous into shoving down your dietary beliefs, thinking that all meat eaters are a bunch of savage, inhumane monsters. Look, I understand on what happens in slaughterhouses are fucking messed up and deplorable. I, I, I agree. These factory farms are deplorable. I, I, I support, like, you know, the old school method in, you know, treating farm animals. Keeping them happy until their time comes. They die happy instead of being all fucking miserable in like a fucking cage where they're like there's no room ahead of them. Uh, we can we're on common grounds on that. But the thing is, you know, this video has no way intention of dissing on people who are vegans, who are vegetarians. If you are vegan, if you're a vegetarian, that is fine by me. Just don't shove your dietary beliefs down my throat and I won't be going all high horse on all of you saying, you know, being a vegan is shit and stuff. I do have friends who are vegan and they respect me as well. But if you don't support PETA, that's fine. If you don't support PETA, that be that is great, but to all the people in PETA, fuck you, fuck all of you. This is like a dick slap in the face of all my relatives living in Detroit. Just if you're gonna go, if you see this video and you're gonna diss the shit on me, go the fuck ahead. I don't honestly give a fuck. Because when you're going around saying go vegan or will not pay your water bills, that's terrorism. That is fucking terrorist tactics. You people are revolting. I'm Atticus the Death Meddler. Hope you like this video. Subscribe to my channel. I have the links on the description below to um, how to help out the people from Detroit, Stoutmeister, and Undertaker Freed's videos. Keep it metal. Have a wonderful day.